Hello everyone, this is a video about the one and only Taylor Swift. I have been a Taylor fan, oh God, it's been ever since probably 2014, but I got big into Taylor as of 2017. That's whenever I became a big time Swifty, and I've been a Swifty ever since. I love Taylor to death, and I just wanted to talk about how Taylor never flops. I mean, there, there's a curse out there for the fourth, that's called the fourth album curse. And Taylor has never flopped, even on her fourth album. Taylor is basically a hit maker. She, she is, she's one of the best musicians out of the whole music industry, in my opinion, to this day, even to this day. And I just wanted to talk about how much I love Taylor. And oh my God, if she saw this video, I will literally die. I mean, I love Taylor so much. I have merch in my house all over the place. I have a bulletin board right there. Y'all can't see it though, but I have a bulletin board all, all about her. I have all of her records, even the re-recordings um, that she's doing now. And I think honestly, the best choice for her to own, um, to own her albums is to do this, to re-record. And I think it's such a genius idea to re-record her music because she needs to own it. And fuck Scooter, fuck, fuck Scott Prashetta, fuck all of them. Um, basically, Taylor is doing what is best for her. And, you know, it's very fun to go back through the eras and re-listen to music that's basically newer now. And her voice has changed so much. And honestly, the best, the best, re or the, the, the most re-recording that I'm looking forward to listening to is Reputation in 1989. Those two albums are connected to my heart and soul because that's whenever I started being a Swifty. And um, Lover, Lover is a very important Taylor Swift album to me because Lover was released before a dark time in my life. And um, that era was, ba was really good for me on my mental health, um, before, you know, everything downfall with the pandemic and all, but, um, I really love Taylor, and if I ever met her, I, I don't know what I would do, I would probably just cry in a corner, because, um, I love her so much, and, um, I mean, she's just amazing. I mean, she never flops in her music. I mean, yes, she's written some songs and released some songs that really didn't do so well, but she's never flopped. She's never flopped. And Lover was unappreciated, but honestly, I think, you know, I think she's amazing. And whoever doesn't like her, like Kim Kardashian, Kanye West, all of them, you know what, fuck them. They, they, they don't, they aren't Taylor. So, um... I really love Taylor, and my message in this video is, is that Taylor never flops, and Taylor will never flop, in my opinion. I think no matter what she releases in the future, um, she won't flop. And she proved that on Folklore in the middle of a pandemic, that she never flops, because Folklore was very different, but it never flopped. And I just love Taylor so much. And thank you for listening to my thoughts about how Taylor never flops and the love, amount of love and support I have for Taylor. And um, thank you for watching. Bye.